When's the last time you made sure the person you were speaking with felt understood? I'm Pinky Shaw here with Fairway Mortgage, and I wanted to share with you an important lesson in how to help others, how to influence others, and how to make a difference for others. And this is something that I learned through uh, a webinar I listened to this weekend on parenting for high schoolers, another webinar I listened to about, uh, it was marketing related, and my life coach, who um, I had my session with last week, who by the way, I highly, highly recommend. So if you're ever looking for one, let me know. I'm happy to share his contact information. But the main message is really about listening to others and when you're having a conversation, not just focusing on what you want to say, but truly, truly listening and letting that person know that they are understood, that you are feeling them, feeling empathetic for them. And it's only when you get them to be in that place that you have the ability to influence, to give advice, to help make a difference for, their, for them. So keep that in mind as you're engaging in conversations with others, and especially when you want to influence, First, make sure you take the time to listen. And this happens with our children, our you know, coworkers, family, friends, there are no amount of time that we're not trying to influence folks, right? And, and sometimes we think it's for their own good, but if they're not ready to receive that information, then we're not making any difference. So something to keep in mind, let me know if you have anything that you can add to this that can help me be a better influencer. And you know, my first context was with respect to my family. Um, so I uh, look forward to hearing your thoughts on this topic. Pinky Shaw here from Fairway Mortgage. Have an amazing day.